refresh, refresh, we fly, we fly. Be good, motherfucker, no lie, no lie. They hate, they hate, you know why, no why. Cause we own, own fire, own fire, own fire, own fire, own fire, own fire, own fire. They hate, you know why, no why. Cause we own, own fire, fresh white teeth, brand new J's. Pockets on swole, god damn it, I'm paid <laughs> Flow sick, you can call it full blown AIDS Stop the whole thing, I'm about to What's going on gamers? In today's video, we gonna go over how to successfully beat man coverage I know you've played a game online and you've seen man coverage probably 8 out of 10 times There's some people that play zone, but there's a lot more people that run man coverage I am in the Bills offensive playbook and this full breakdown and scheme five different plays and four different formations is going to be updated in the ebook and the Patreon and we got a sale going right now but let's stop talking and get into what y'all came to see but drop a like make sure you subscribe if you new. the first thing you want to do you want to take away players that are able to be pressed so you can see me freeze the screen to the left rewind it get your popcorn pay attention write this stuff down so now i'm making my substitutions and the play that we are going to go over in this video is the bills y post like i said i'm in the bills offensive playbook and my full breakdown scheme is going to be over this and it's going to dominate man coverage plus you got your cover two cover three and some pretty decent runs in the same formation then you got small package formations that you can use so now that we got that out the way let's go over a couple ways to beat man rpo zones very effective this year you can run rpos very effective they have to put a hard flat on the field in order for that person to jump one of the routes now we're going to go over our main play again. The first setup that I like to use is if you have slot apprentice, put him in the crossing route and motion him across the field. Now, also, you want to put a drag on the field if possible. On this play, I didn't put the drag, but that's something that I would like to do on man coverage. The reason the drag is so important is because it's unbumpable. Now, when you motion somebody across in a drag or a slant, that makes that route unbumpable most of the time too. So on this setup, we got a zig with the B. We always got the running back. Either they have the hard flat play underneath to stop him, and then we got the tight end apprentice. And I just wanted the pass lead up as soon as he gets separation because people are usually dropping zones on the field, either 15, 20, or 25 yards back. Now, the key to any offense is keeping them honest so once you start passing successfully they start putting extra zones and stuff on the field and cross manning that's when you want to mix in your run your inside zone your read option your counters your traps so another setup we about to go over we got the tight end apprentice all eyes has been on him in this offense make sure you have that so you can be at an advantage so you can see tight end apprentice you can see the drag underneath his user was one step behind and it don't matter the tight end only has like 84 speed his user is probably 87 88 speed but if he's not watching them correctly it's gonna be a tutty tutty so here we go with a bonus defensive tip this is in my ebook and on the patreon so don't hesitate start winning today it's gonna show you how to do the best zone defense in the game and all you have to do is just lurk across the middle of the field as you can see right there i send him from one zone to another but let's get back on the offense side of the ball because this is what y'all here for so we got the tight end apprentice all eyes is on him and now with the slot apprentice we able to put a double move on the field we got a slant going across with the b and the running back will be wide open based on how his formation is right now so that's another key thing to remember so we motion him across he's looking for the tight end apprentice he's trying to stay underneath it to get a pick and our double move gets over the top of the defense for a tutty tutty now we do got four more plays that can beat all coverages a full defense in the ebook and also three more formations that i use let's go <laughs> 